Hi guys, today I want to walk you through how I use my Canon 80D as a webcam for meetings on my Mac Mini. I purchased my Canon 80D back in 2016 thinking that I was gonna use this camera to become a professional photographer. Well, it ended up collecting dust more than anything. I really didn't use it to its full potential until two years ago. Even though nowadays I have Andrew's nice cameras to play with, I still rely very heavily on the AED. I still think it produces high quality videos that I'm happy with under the condition that it's sitting on a tripod in a very controlled environment. Some quick specs about the Canon 80D if you are unfamiliar with it. It was first released in February 2016 with a price around $1,200. It is not a full frame or mirrorless camera. It is a DSLR with a Canon EF mount. It can shoot in 24, 30, and 60 frames per second in 1920 by 1080. You can't shoot in C-Log, but there are multiple picture profiles that you can customize and play with. Before I show you how I set up my camera, there are a few accessories that you'll need in order to use your Canon 80D as a webcam. You will need a tripod, a battery, and I highly recommend that you use a dummy battery. It is a lifesaver. You will need a mic. I usually just use my AirPods for meeting and you will need a mini USB to connect the camera to your computer. You will also need to download a few softwares. You will need the Canon EOS utility and the OBS studio. To download OBS studio, search for OBS studio download and make sure the Apple logo is highlighted for Mac OS, then hit download installer. To download the EOS Utility app, just Google Canon EOS Utility. Choose ADD under the model. Under software, select EOS Utility for Mac OS. Lastly, just run the installer for both apps like you would for any other software. First, let's talk about how I chose the location to set up my camera. I really prefer to use natural lighting, so I have my tripod set up right next to the window. And so I have natural lighting coming in this way. And my tripod is set up in the corner of my room because I know in this corner, I get the most depth in my shot. One issue I have with the way I have my camera set up right now, when I'm in a meeting and if I look at the screen, I'm actually not looking directly into the camera, so I'm not really looking at the people in the meeting. One way to avoid that is to set up your camera as close to the monitor as possible. So you could set up the camera right under your monitor. You will probably need a wider lens if you do set up your camera on your desk. So make sure your battery is ready to go and let's connect the camera to the computer. So you will just plug the mini USB into your camera and connect it to the computer. Open EOS Utility to make sure we like the setting on the camera. If your camera is connected, remote shooting should be clickable. And now we will check our settings to see if you need to adjust the ISO. Do you need to fix the white balance or zoom in and out a little bit? Once you like these settings, exit the app and we'll open OBS Studio. The reason why I have to use OBS Studio is because the Zoom app is unable to recognize my camera as an external webcam. I think it is an issue with the M1 Mac Mini. And this is how OBS Studio looks like. We will create a scene and add a new video capture source. Choose EOS Webcam Utility and you should see your ADD.
The last step in the app is to hit start virtual camera. And now we are ready to start our meeting. Join a meeting or simply test it in the setting to see if your camera is working correctly. And it looks like it's working properly. Just make sure that you have your mic set up too. That's it for this quick tutorial. Hopefully you found it to be helpful. I'm sure our cameras will be so happy to be utilized again. That's it for today. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.